the hell is that guy doing over there? He's just climbing for whatever reason. How's it hanging, everybody? It's your boy Lobo with Ron returning to some more Street Fighter 6 World Tour. And when we last left off, we made it to Neishao. We talked to um, Manon and became her student back in France. And now we're about to check out this tournament. Wow, this guy. His name is Punch. Move, Ricardo. Who you? What? Yeah, what do you want? From the look of you, I take you're a fighter. You're a tournament competitor? Who you're with and where you're from? Metro City. And you must be either with Mad Gang or the Crows. So which one of them you are? Which one? I'm repping Mad Gear. Hey, quit the fibbing, jerk. So I know they haven't even locked in a rep yet. If you want to compete, go back to Metro and lock things in there first. If you're a spectator, you gotta sit tight till they kick off the bracket. And if you're neither, then get lost already! Great, now I gotta return to Metro City. God, these guys are annoying. You know, before I even make it to Metro... Before I make it to Metro, I feel like I should make a quick stop somewhere. Let's go visit India. Yeah, hey, there's Ganesh. Here we are. We're gonna visit. We're gonna visit Geef and um, Dalsim to finish up the trainers. To finish up the 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 train the the fighters around the world. Anyways, I still gotta visit um, Honda and uh, a few others like Jury and them. But we can at least see some of these guys right here. Um, Ron? Dolson as tranquil as ever. Looking nice. Looking sleek. Yeah. Um, so I before okay, this is gonna be a full disclosure right here right here and right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this all the way. I'm probably not gonna be doing um when it comes to the story, I will only do the story. I'm only gonna try to get the story done like as soon as possible. So I can just um wrap things up and so i can enjoy the world tour on my own time so with that being said i'm gonna have to make some changes which is going to be um unfortunately you're not gonna see most of the uh if anything i'll probably cut them into shorts into bits of me meeting the um me meeting the other fighters so we still meet we still need to meet jury and um that's probably and kimberly Kimberly's on top of the rooftops, and we still haven't found Jury yet for some reason. But when we get there, we will get there, of course. So we're gonna be mostly um, the next time when I right when I finish this, we're, when I come back, I'm probably gonna finish things up in a live stream. But we'll see what happens. So let's see what we got what going on get here. For you? What we got going on here? Dal Curry. So India is known for their curry, and it, apparently it's like really, really good. Wrenches, why? Um, I'll take this. Please come again. What you got going on here? A turban. Ooh, initiates chain. Interesting. I will gladly equip this because it's more damage. First off. And the turban seems like I can equip this for more damage. The turban is not even orange. Cool. 
Cool. Take care. Yep. All right. All right, cool. All right, so turban, blue. Um, we won't worry about that. Initiates chain, karate gloves. Uh, as much as I would love to keep the karate gloves, I need it for appearances. I need it for appearance. So I'm going to have to find some other gloves. I'm going to have to find the gloves again and replace. Or I can use the bangles. So you got the initiates chain right here. Um, I guess for now we'll stick with these gloves. We'll stick with the bracelets. Screw it. Alright. There we go. Let's talk to Dawson. Hmm. Hmm. Are you lost, child? This is a place for discovering one's path. Face yourself. Calmly. Mm -hmm. Quietly. Oh. The look in your eyes. You are here in search of something. In search of me, perhaps? If you are here for my teachings, I shall not turn you away. Well, do you intend to train here? I do indeed. Understood. Let us start with your form. We begin. Whoa. <laughs> you can do it, Ron. He's like, I'm not even done to the first stage yet. Fuck. <laughs> there is no need to rush. Listen to what your body needs. Oh. He's like, yeah, but I still want to do that, man. <laughs> Your mastery of miraculous arts does not make you superior to others. Be ever mindful of your place in this world. Of course. And now, we are Dalsum students. So we know Yoga Fire and Yoga Teleport. Cool, sis. Okay, I get it. Jesus. Hey, Dalsum. Have you heard? Prayer to Agni lies at the confluence of my power. Agni is the keeper of the fire of thought. Through prayer, we can master arts of spiritual concentration. Yoga. The flames I call forth are the results of that superhuman focus. It is the foundation upon which yoga is built. Okay. So, we all know that Dalsum is pretty damn cool. That much is for certain. Uh, I am not good enough to play as Dalsum's style. But I'm going to have to do that on my own time. Zangief is pretty damn awesome. And I want to see what the training is with you guys. With um, with this, with this guy. With, so Zangief and Honda. We're going to use. um, We're going to see at least those. Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> that's a apparently that's an ultimate muscle reference.
Yeah, look at that pose, man. Dude, the face, the facial features. The Red Cyclone. You're gonna give him his thing back, right, Ron? You're not gonna keep it for yourself. There he is. There he is. Look at that big dude. Damn, he's tall. You guys are tall too. Zangif. Zangif don't like fighting lower ranked opponents. Says he's afraid to throw him. <laughs> More for me then. I ain't holding back against no martial artist. The heat from the furnaces is off the chain, and you know what else? The pursuit of gains. I better cool off before my pecs burn off. Cool. Hmm? Those muscles. You're a fighter, yes? You've crafted your physique with care, I see, but you still got a few rough edges. What do you say to training under me? Together we will build some beautiful, very beautiful muscles. Beautiful muscles? Sign me up! <laughs> Train me like you mean it. You've got spirit, I like that. The gains you will make here, they will defy description. We will be comrades in sculpted muscular arms. And if you ever find yourself in trouble, simply let me know. Now then, where to begin? Ah, uh, yes. We begin with basic strength training. Is this when we're gonna do start lifting weights? Oh shit. Hey, 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 hey. Look at this man go. Nothing is impossible. Not if you keep training. Squeeze every last muscle. You can do it. Hey. Put your heart into it. Left. There, a bit more. Good things await. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Here, the good things as <laughs> He's struggling. Fucking, you saw Rod's face. He was struggling, man. <laughs> you learn quickly like a sponge, a sponge of muscle, with power welling up from within. Yes. <laughs> if you ever want to train, you know where to find me. Hell yeah, dude. They did very well with fucking Zangief's facial expressions, man. Like the expressions in this game is so good, it's crazy. Hey, we got double lariat. All right, Zangief, before I leave, mm -hmm. mm, a gift for me? Hey, how would you like a wooden bear, buddy? Now, here's a honey-loving creature I'd recognize everywhere. Fierce and bold with the strength to back it up. Bears are incredible animals. I once, I fought one once, you know? And let me tell you, it was no easy fight. More than a few of the scars on my body of mine are reminders of that particular encounter. <laughs> Just seeing this is enough to set my hairs on end. I can feel my muscles getting ready to fight for their life. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey. What are your muscles saying today? <laughs> Spare me your furrowed brow. Listening to your muscles daily is a fundamental step in ensuring your, their growth. In good times or bad, your muscles are always there for you. Conversely, they will always share their feelings. Perk up your ears and listen. Do you hear that voice? Communication is key to beautiful, healthy muscle tone. Never, ever forget that. My body of steel! Nah, see, now nah, we have to do it. Hey, hey, Zangief. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Alright, thanks, man. We'll be back to talk to you later. So back in town, find anything about the arena in Nashville? Huh, so you were mistaken for a competitor? Gotcha, gotcha. Know what that means, Ron? You've gotten so good, people can tell you're a fighter just by looking at you. 
But this could be a golden opportunity. What I'm thinking is, what if you can sneak into the tournament for real? I bet we'll find a gold mine in info. Now this is going to sound annoying, but you should negotiate with Thrasher. If you're able to become a Mad Gear rep, they might be your ticket in. I was going to go there anyways, love. Ooh, we got some, some new stuff at the shop. Hey, we got some new stuff at the shop, yeah? Oh, at this shop. Interesting. So, we got to go talk to Thrasher, yeah. Find Thrasher and talk to him. So, we got we most likely got to go at night. You know what? I'm I might as well go check out what's at the shop and go talk to um talk to Honda. I mean, I'm like right there. I was going to end it with talking to Honda, but I I'm changing my mind. Hey, yo, what? A wrestler mask? Okay. The ripped jeans. They're kind of similar to the... Well, they're not similar to the style I want, but they're, they're a style nonetheless. I'll equip it for appearances only. Yo, these boxing shoes, though. Hey, boxing gloves. Loose socks. What's with the cat paws? And a jacket. Okay. Cool. But nonetheless, we're gonna go talk to Honda. The other characters, um, Jury, Jamie, and Kimberly, I'm probably gonna use bits for it. Who knows? Honda! I can tell by looking at you that you're not here for the chancos, Stu. No, you're the kind of person who's always looking for an opportunity to get buff. Is that the impression I give? The fire in a person's eyes never lie. Let me treat you to a little sumo training. This is what I was waiting for. Sumo training. Jesus. Damn, we got his classic outfit? Why he in the classic outfit? He's a fucking wall. Jesus. Why is he in his classic outfit? What's wrong? Nobody ever got strong without losing. Don't lose hope. Hell yeah. This dude was a Let's fucking stop. tower. I could tell by looking at you that you got a knack for it. So how about I teach you one of my patented sumo techniques? Yeah. Teach away. <laughs> There's never any harm in learning a thing or two. Wow, he actually trains you and asks if you want to become a student or not. Cool. Yes, I got 100 hand slaps. And sumo headbutt. Okay. Isn't this Oh, you're going to give me a present? Um, what do you like, my guy? How about a pack? All right, now this is something. All right, should make a great decoration for Edelman. Sorry, I had a hiccup. I had the hiccups there for a minute. You're right. Uh, putting sumo in the worldwide spotlight. Now that's always been a dream of mine. Opening a sumo restaurant and working with folks like you is all part of that plan. Get the world chowing on chanko, and there'll be sumo heads before you know it. And hey. I got to meet someone with some serious, I got to meet someone with serious sumo skills like Good yourself. Stuff. Pretty sure that alone was worth the price of opening this darn restaurant. Oh man, you're, you're such a nice guy. 
Honda! Honda! I got his classic outfit like really early because I got I had the freaking I had the fighter coins to get it. Which I'm kind of upset, but like it is what it is. Alright. So we gotta go meet Thrasher Dam and see what we got going on here. So they just wanna fight you. And fight you and fight you. Bullet, I don't have time for you. <laughs> I knew we meet again. Track things down to the tournament in Nashau, did you? Right? It's exactly what you're thinking. The money that got passed along to the Shadow Remnants, that was basically the entry fee to that tournament. That's what Bosch up and swiped. Well, I want he wants in on the tournament. If we do well at that tourney, it'll put Mad Gear back on the map. And you, you're the one I was hoping to send as our champion. That's why we had the girl kidnapped. I'm real glad to hear you're planning to compete. That works out swell for us. There's just one little problem. Damn it. You know the crows, don't you? Those feather brains are flapping in our faces as usual. Yeah, what else is new? They're saying they're the ones that are who are going to send the rep from Metro City. Those birds sticking their beaks where they don't belong. Are we just going to let them? Hell no, we That's ain't. Enough. That's where you come in, Ron. Go talk to the crows for me, will ya? Once we shut those crows up, you'll be the rep of Metro City. Alright, so we gotta rep Metro City. So the crows hideout, that's the west side of town. They squatted in a building that's set for demolition. Turned, that, turned it into their HQ. So, is it by Siren? Is it like... The, the building where the parkways are? The parkings are? What? Uh, so about the two biggest gangs in Metro City? Bunch of butt heads, button heads, huh? And I want front row seats and a bucket of popcorn on this one. Oh, let me guess. I'm wondering, you know how I know about this? Well, never underestimate a FooTuber's Intel network. I mean, you stand out so much. How could I have not heard of it? Anywho, you're up against the crows, right? Better make sure you're ready. Something tells me there's going to be a lot of requests of, for help popping up all over the place. And I'm not just talking about Metro City. Nashville and other places, too. And let me guess. I bet you're wondering how bad I know about this. This is pure instinct talking. I can just, like, tell. So take it with a grain of salt and don't come crying to me if I'm way off, okay? Who would be crying, Mr. N... In Footurber, your your Footurber looking ass. You are about to get your ass kicked, lady. All right. Crowbar. Ah, you guys. What do you want? This is the Crow Stronghold. Who the hell are you? What? You're from Mad Gear? Not every day we get an enemy enemy operative just strolling up to the front gates. You've got a few screws, screws loose, buddy. You're free to go, though, if you're ready to be crow child, that is. <gasps> buddy, you do not know who you're messing with. Head to the crow's nest. Yeah, you're gonna... You guys are about to get wrecked. Alright, first off, before I completely rock your asses, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. And... Okay, okay. I gotta eat those later. Hmm, nice. Wait, what kind of pants do you got? Cargo pants? Oh, well, the masks look a little bit interesting. Jeez. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. And stop calling me boss, okay, Jandy? It's Mr. Rudra. 
high. Understood, Mr. Basrudra. But you gotta call me Trendy Hot then. All my friends do. We'll talk later, okay? Who in the blue hell are you? And what are you doing on our turn? <laughs> Blue's kind of right. We got a real fighter on our hands here. He wants in on the nice shall tournament. Hmm. Is that a fact? I tell the organizers we're sending one of our own to the tournament, and then Thrasher scrambles like an idiot and sends you here. Huh? I was gearing up for a good brawl, you know? Now we got ourselves a bona fide main event. We got the Crows versus Mad Gear. You go round up for the best. This has been a long time coming. We're gonna find out which one of us is worthy of repping Metro City. Tell Frasher to get ready. The crows will be waiting. Huh. Oh shit. This design is pretty cool, Rudra. Interesting guy. I wonder if he's a potential DLC character. I doubt it, but <laughs> one can th one can think, you know. One can just think. Do you wanna die? Street Fighter Six. Street Fighter Six. Alrighty then. Um, Thrasher, yo, Rudra wants to wants right. to think. A team battle? Give me a freaking break. Ah, whatever. I guess it's fine. In this city, if someone's coming at you looking for a fight, you accept, and then you make them regret ever thinking about it. And guess who's going to be the team captain? You, Ron. Now go find us some teammates, will ya? Oh, jeez. Head, head to the East Mountain Path at the base of the... Whoa. What? Hey. If you're gonna go to the trouble of finding folks, you better be damn sure they're well, they're worth the crap. My goons? Yeah, I'm gonna say no, considering you know you kind of thrash most of them and all. And if you're traveling the world to get stronger, right? I heard a rumor that there's a bunch of fighting obsessed folks hanging around the mountain in Neshal. Go search over there for starters. Jesus, back at Neshal we go. Okay. Here we go back to Neshal. Neshal, because I'm different. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Woo! Woo! I'm gonna talk to all of these characters later. But first up. I hate the tracking that most of you guys do. Well, too bad for you. Alright, so we gotta go to the mountain base. Recruitment drive. Later, hater. Buddy, stop. You're only hurting yourself. Oh, well, I can't apparently go through there now, can I? Alright, how do I get over there? The mountain pass, I have to go through here or cut to the bottom. Oh! Oh! I'll find out those outfits later. Um, probably. I'm gonna need you to leave me alone, though. Alright. What? Stop right there. I can't let you through... You best have the footing of a mountain goat if you're brave. If you brave those kinds of trails, there's a different route up from the east side of town. Pretty much better, a much better place to get your bearings, I'd say. Uh, you really have to make things annoying for me, huh? Ooh, what's this? Sun, sun, the video game. Cozies. 
All right, I think we made it to the path that we need to get to now. Let's go ahead and speed run through this. Yeah. Bow. Um, hello? I sense your search for powerful fighters. <laughs> you won't be disappointed. Interesting. Oh shit. Psycho energy. Psycho power. This guy got kicked upside his head. No way. How shameful. That was the fighter hunter everyone's been talking about. Plenty of fighters training on the mountain were beaten by that guy. Word is, he's an entrance in the Lowlands fighting tournament. Witnessing that kind of power brought to bear on the fighters here was unreal. He's clearly in a league of his own. So we gotta, we're find, we gotta freaking find a, the fighter hunter? Ooh, Gonda. Real shame. Damn it all. That cardboard-headed jerk just came out of nowhere and gave me clobbering. He used some seriously wild techniques, too. I think he called it psycho something or another. Some kind of key-based stuff. So, psycho power. Cardboard combatant. Oh, shit. Wait, I don't remember equipping rolling attack. Oh, what? Whoa, dude. Oh, shit. Whoa, he's using... Whoa, this guy is ridiculous, actually. Okay. Bro, you keep doing that, we're gonna have some fucking problems. Okay, I got something here. Ah, fudge nutters. Dude, I almost had something going with the Blanca ball roll. Let's go. We almost did something. <laughs> um, what? Uh, what? I got my butt handed to me by some guy who's hunting down fighters. He was impressive, sure, but I swear I sent some sort of fragility in him. I'm not losing next time, that's for damn sure. Anyway, what's your deal? Huh? You're looking for the fighters for a team battle? Eh, don't think I'm going to be much help in this sorry state, sadly. Better ask someone else. I think it's probably going to come down to the fact that we're just going to fight. What is it? Um... This way may take you to Mount Vaishal. Under normal circumstances, you can ride up on horseback, but this is not an option right now due to construction. I hate to say it, but it's blocked off for the time being. Shouldn't be that much longer, though. Um, okay, what am I supposed to do now? Um, what's going on here? I'm not, I'm not able to... Okay, it's bugged. What's going on here? What's going on here? Why is it bugged? There we go. Jesus. 
Yo, Ron, it's me. Busy mountain climbing because I got some info for you. Let me tell you about your opponent. We digged up some dirt on this first guy. Sounds like he's a brick house. You're going to need to do more than wail on him a bunch. Next is some info of who's going to be in your corner. Sounds like my guys have narrowed down a few candidates for you. Nice of them to do something since they're totally useless for once. I, I, oh, jeez. I botched that. So, um, nice of them to be something other than totally useless for once. I told them they should be toughing up if they really wanted to pull their weight. Uh-huh, maybe next time I can see, <laughs> maybe the next time I see a pig fly. Anyway, let's see here. There's this one guy in the lowlands, one guy in Old Neishao. And another candidate in Metro City, by the looks of it. Whoever you want to approach is up to you. But I'd be sure to size them up before making a decision. Anyway, later. So follow the advice and find the first member of your team. Which is probably... <sighs> Get out of here. Jesus, man. These guys are annoying as hell. Annoying as hell, that's for damn sure. Bros, leave me alone. No, why is that? No. Can I please leave? Yo, let me leave. Oh, you came down the mountain? You must be made of some tough stuff. Go on through then. At this point, there's no way this town is going to hold you back, Dan. Enjoy your time in the shop, my friend. Yeah, I'm fucking strong. Alright, well, Ron is strong. Okay? So, piss off. All of you. You guys are annoying me. Uh, Damini. Can I help you? A team battle? I'm a Neishao native, but hey, helping decide the Metro City rep sounds fun. I've got, I put a ton of work into my striking moves every day, without exception. Time to put them to the test. Still, uh, I'm sure you've got other candidates in mind, right? You sure you want me on the team? Change my mind. Let me go check out this person in... Let me go check out, wait, who's this? Recruitment drive, recruitment drive. Alright, who's this? Ricardo. What's up? Looking for teammates? Well, I'm game. Just one thing, though. I'm not very strong, so long as you're cool with that. No. The fuck? Let's go back to freaking Metro City, then. Jesus. Besta. What is it? Looking to recruit me? Been years since I was invited to a street fight. I'm a money guy now. Seriously, hustle grinder. But hey, I'm more than happy to show up and throw some chumps around. Mm, oh. Sure, why not? Better get prepared then. Found the first member? Okay, your second opponent's a little different. This one's about attacking from a distance. Um... First, there's a guy in Kung Fu. The second one is an elite in England. There's a note here. Not always present. The hell is that supposed to be? Alyssa. Mad Gear Alyssa? Whoa, she even left a little... Gotta get... Wish she realized how serious this was. Oh. I gotta pay attention to the notes left behind what he said. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so I got to pay attention to what Thrasher's telling me here. Because if not, I'm going to get myself w rocked. Um, so, you need, the first guy is a brick house. You're going to need to do more than just wail on him. Okay, good. So I got that. Um... So I got that right. I got uh, this dude. So the second one here. Uh, no. Nope. Alright. So first member. Second opponent's attack from a distance. 
So we need to find the elite. We need to find the elite in England, I think. To, to, to do this properly, I feel. Violet. Hi, Cammy. Let's add a new weapon to your arsenal, shall we? I advise against using it in a life or death situation until you've mastered it, however. Spinning drive smasher. Finish. Cool. Oh. You should talk some more. Question. Sometimes the outcome of a battle costs someone their life. You know this. Yet you fight nonetheless. Why is this? Well, for me... For Ron here, it's to protect the innocent. I see. You endure danger to protect. If you act with thought and conviction, then yours is a battle with no shortage of meaning. It's an answer that is also in accord with Delta Red's okay. ideals. Ask yourself why you fight with your life on the line. If you are unable, I cannot authorize you for combat. Cammy, I'll talk to you later, love. Right now, we're going to talk to Violet here. Can I help you? A team battle? Huh. Sounds like a good time. I specialize in aerial combat. I'm not quite on par with Cammy, mind you. But I'm, I'll manage... I'll manage well enough. You want me on the team? Um, yes. Ooh. Let's make this a good one. All right. Yo. All right. Sent me a schedule for the team battle. Now get your butt back here and we got some stuff to talk about. All right. All right, man. What do you want to talk about? Hey. How'd it go? You find some serious brawlers to join in on the action? What? You just need one more. What a pen in the A. Fine, got it. The final member is me. Bam, full team. Now we gotta bring the fight to the crows. Let's clobber those pros once and for all. We're going on ahead. Come through once you're all set and ready to rock. Alright. So now... This will be about it for Street Fighter 6. Now, <laughs> look at the muscles. <laughs> now, when we come back, we'll probably do a live stream. We'll probably start doing live streams to get closer to finishing up the story. Um, I'm going to try to get these videos out as soon as possible within the next two days. So that way, during the weekend comes, we'll try to finish the world tour. Um, in the meantime, I'm probably going to be farming like all hell without you guys noticing. And so just take notice that we, Ron is level 41. I'm going to try to get him to at least level 50 if so, if possible. Maybe, 50, maybe 55 at best. But that'll be all it for me and Ron. So if you guys happen to enjoy the video, be sure to like, subscribe, tap the bell notification, or smash all three if you think that's not enough. And you'll be notified on upcoming streams and videos that I will be posting in the future. And just remember that I will return to Street Fighter VI World Tour with our good buddy Ron. Alright, Ron, it's time to say goodbye. And we will see you next time. Howling out.